This is the workshop of our latest Africa's Heart project. The women have been sewing for a number of months now. They were taught by a volunteer who came and initiated the project and brought some beautiful designs with her. And now it's being expanded. We've hired Jacqueline, who's from an Arab village in the Galilee. And of course, we have different women who come. And as they come to us, they come from the prison, they come from the border. These are Eritrean and Sudanese refugees, women who have, some of them, suffered terrible traumas at the hands of the Bedouin smugglers, violence and rape and extortion. And they come here pretty shattered. So our desire is to give them something that they can sit and do and create. And they actually get 100% of what they produce. We pay them for the work that they do. They have been learning how to do it. Each of their, their, their bags is unique. They put a different inside, outside. We have several different styles. Each woman has a tag on their bag with their name on it. And in doing so, we identify who made the bag. We're able to give them the, the money for it. And I think that it's significant because it gives them a sense of uh, accomplishment as they're healing, as they're growing. And of course, in their time here, it's significant to us to see them grow into uh, wholeness and into healing. And we're very thankful for each of the women. We have about 15 women living here, and we try to integrate the women into the project as much as we can. So it has been a very significant effort for us, and we hope to expand it. One of the areas that we have already been working in is to do beading. We even have our, our children learning how to do it because we take in children here that are unaccompanied minors, children that have been abandoned, or children who have lost their parents at the border through, through violence, even murder. So we take in the children, and this is a wonderful thing for our kids to do as well. And so it's part of the Africa's Heart Project. Jess has been working with us and helping to oversee the project, buying the materials. We are very open to, to different fabrics. In fact, we're asking friends from Asia to bring us fabrics. So we have different ones that uh, to fit all kinds of tastes. And again, as I said, here's some of the small ones and other styles that we have. So we hope there's something for everybody. So we don't sell in stores. People come here or we can ship them out to others. But we appreciate very much if you stand with us so that we can support the women in this project.